when you're dealing with, with those cultures that really value relationship, and it's not just Latinos, but Asians, people in the Middle East, you've got to take your time. It's not just, let's get down to business. But then, I want to share a story with you about the role of acculturation. Now, I was in Mexico City. I was called to this meeting. I was so excited. We were going to do a training program for the uh, Galavision large TV network. And we had a contact. The owner of the TV network knew about our work, and he wanted to hire us. So I was really pumped. But we had to get by the chief of staff. So we go into this guy. He's very interesting, by the way. He was a Nipponophile. He loved things Japanese. And that's when, if you remember, uh, that's when they had the um, Shogun. So it was very, very, it was very, very Japanese, but he was very, very Mexican. And I thought, okay, I'm really comfortable. I put my Latino hat. We go in, we sit down, and I'm starting to chat him up. And then he pounds on the desk, and he says, okay, Dr. Ehrlich, Cut the baloney. Let's get down to business. I was shocked. Well, I didn't do my homework. This guy went to undergraduate, got his master's and his PhD at Harvard. He was probably more Americanized than I am. 